Record and use the circuit symbols shown in section six of the syllabus. Draw and interpret circuit diagrams as containing the circuit symbols shown in section six of the syllabus. We'll be talking about the electromotive force of a source as energy transferred per unit charge in driving a charge around a complete circuit. We'll be distinguishing between EMF and potential difference in terms of energy considerations. We'll be talking about the effects of internal resistance of a source of EMF and on the terminal potential difference. Then we'll be talking about Kirchhoff's laws, recall Kirchhoff's first law, and understand that it is a consequence of conservation of charge. Recall Kirchhoff's second law and understand that it is a con consequence of conservation of energy. Derive using Kirchhoff's laws a formula for the combined resistance of two or more resistors in series. Use the formula for the combined resistance of two or more resistors in series. Then we'll talk about how we can derive using Kirchhoff's laws a formula for the combined resistance of two or more resistors in parallel. We'll be talking about the formula for the combined resistance of two or more resistors in parallel. And we'll use Kirchhoff's laws to solve simple circuit problems. Uske baad hum baat karenge potential divider circuit pe. That uh, the principle of potential divider circuit, the principle of potentiometer as means of comparing potential differences. We'll understand the use of a galvanometer in null methods. And we'll explain the use of thermistors and LDRs in potential dividers to provide a potential difference that is dependent on temperature and light intensity. We'll also be practicing a lot in this chapter as well. Uh, and remember that I've given you the worksheet again, which is due by Friday. We'll discuss the electricity worksheet on Friday. Okay? The electricity worksheet till then. Okay, so moving on. Then I'll give you DC circuits when we finish this chapter. Let us begin. Okay, then I'll give you subsequently waves, superposition, and all of that. Okay, as you can see here, uh, this is uh, these are the circuit symbols from your AS level, right? This is a cell. Uh, this is the positive terminal of the cell. This is the negative terminal of the cell. And this is also the battery of cells. You have different cells which are in series. Positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative. This is a switch. Yeah, we open switch. This is open, right? When you do it with this, it will close. Now it is open. But when this point, this attaches with this one, this become a closed, you know, switch. This is the earth connection that you can see here. Teen aapko ye steps for the earth connection. This is the power supply, as you can see here. Simple power supply, but uh, this is a DC power supply, right? Okay, and the AC power supply is like this, with a sinusoidal waveform. This is a junction of conductors. You can see here that these are the junctions. This is the point that we have where they are attached. This is a lamp. We have to pass a lamp here. This is a fixed resistor. This is a variable resistor. And a thermistor is like this with a tick. You can see that here. Yeah, it's like a bending resistor. ये आपके पास हीटर का सिंबल है इसी तरह से आपके पास ये अर्थ है ये इलेक्ट्रिक बेल है दिस इज अ बजर दिस इज अ माइक्रोफोन लाउड स्पीकर वी हैव अ मोटर हियर यू कैन सी हियर मोटर के साथ ये लगा होता है दिस इज अ जनरेटर द एमीटर इज फॉर द करंट द वोल्ट मीटर इज फॉर द पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस दिस इज अ गैल्वानोमीटर गैल्वानोमीटर गिव्स यू द डायरेक्शन ऑफ द करंट गिव्स द Direction of the current. Remember that. This is an oscilloscope. You can see that this is a sort of voltage, sort of voltage. This is an oscilloscope. This is a capacitor. Uh, you have a capacitor in AS and A2 in the chapter. 
दिस इज द लाइट इमिटिंग डायोड इसको हम कहते हैं एलईडी लेट्स मूव टू वर्ड्स द मेन थियोरी ऑफ दिस टॉपिक तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट व्हाट इज मेंट बाय ईएमएफ राइट इलेक्ट्रोमोटिव फोर्स इलेक्ट्रोमोटिव फोर्स we call that emf it's by the way not the force so ye force nahi hai ye kuch aur hai main aapko batata hu kya hai for example we have here a circuit in which we have a battery and we have here a resistor like this we have here an ammeter let's say i attach a voltmeter here this is the emf that we have the current in the circuit is i you should know that to produce a constant flow of charge in an electric circuit a source of emf is required isko hum kehte hain electromotive force ye jo aapko ye nazar aa rahi hai battery this is right emf source but what is electromotive force electromotive force which we call the emf we can write here that the electromotive force of a source is the energy provided by the source this is the source by the way the charge around the complete circuit aap is jo charge hoga usko aap energy denge taaki wo pure circuit mein flow kare usko emf kehte hain work done per unit charge right the motive force is for the entire circuit potential difference is across a component लेकिन यहाँ पे इसमें एक फर्क भी है ईएमएफ में आप एनर्जी प्रोवाइड करते हैं चार्ज को मूव करने के लिए ठीक है और पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस में ये होता है कि एनर्जी दो पॉइंट्स के क्रॉस डिसिपेट होती है मतलब इलेक्ट्रिकल से नॉन इलेक्ट्रिकल फॉर्म्स में कन्वर्ट हो जाती है पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस में और नॉन इलेक्ट्रिकल से इलेक्ट्रिकल में चली जाती है ई में नॉन इलेक्ट्रिकल हम कह रहे हैं केमिकल एनर्जी को जो ई सोर्स के अंदर so what is electromotive force you should know that the, the electromotive force which is e is the chemical mechanical or other forms of energy that are converted into electrical energy when unit charge passes to the source so basically what's happening is the chemical energy generator mein mechanical energy bhi hoti hai aap rotate karwate hain magnet ko between the coils yeah your coil grow rate karwate hain between the magnet so it's the chemical mechanical or other forms of energy that are converted into electrical energy when unit charge uh, passes through the source so uh, the formula for this is emf is work done per unit charge the work done is the energy that is converted from non electrical to electrical forms right this is in joules this is in coulomb the charge is in coulomb and emf ka agar aap dekhe to wo hai volts mein jo aapke paas emf hai that is in volt and i'm going to write here that the si units are volt so you should know that the si unit emf is volt this include what emf sources include batteries cells we have power supplies we also have ac generators all of these are emf sources let's move towards the the ideal cell and the conservation of energy and then internal resistance right aapke paas ek jo ideal cell ek aisa cell hota hai jiske koi internal resistance nahi hota internal resistance hota hai battery ke andar battery ka resistance so this is the emf source we have here the resistance i call this r1 there is another resistance here i call this r2 this is the emf source that we have and the current that is flowing is i as it flow karega charge jab flow karega to obviously there will be a potential difference some work is done the work done is w1 let's say the work done here is w2 the energy that is dissipated right and this emf is providing the work w right it's an ideal cell so we have here an ideal cell ideal cell is such a cell which has zero internal resistance right ideal cell here such a cell has zero internal resistance what's happening is no energy 
is lost as heat when the unit charge flows within the cell. Uske andar resistance nahi hai, right? No energy is lost as heat when unit charge flows through the cell. Hota kya hai ki basically the, what what's happening with the potential difference? The potential difference is by all means the potential difference is the energy energy converted from electrical to other forms dekhiye yahan se current ja raha hai to electrical energy se other forms mein convert ho raha hai difference is the energy converted from electrical to other forms and emf is the energy converted from non electrical to other forms so non non electrical energy is here in the cell from non electrical to electrical forms right by conservation of energy we have this stuff here by conservation of energy you should know that that we have W is equal to W1 plus W2. ये जो work done जो battery ने provide किया है वो यहाँ पे use हुआ है. We divide it with charge Q. We can divide this with charge Q to maintain the equality. Comes W over Q, W1 over Q plus W2 over Q. W over Q is what we call the EMF. But this energy that is dissipated over between these two points is the potential difference we want. Plus this potential difference V two. But this tells us what that the, the EMF is the sum of potential differences, internal resistance. What is internal resistance? You should know that all power supplies, जितने power supplies हैं कपने के internal resistance होता है, right? हर battery का, हर power supply का अपना एक internal resistance होता है. So all power supplies have have some resistance between their terminals called internal resistance so we have here something like this you have a source like this you have here a small resistor we call this acha ye resistor as in resistor nahi hai ye battery ke andar jo chemicals hai uska resistance so this is the emf that we have this is point a this is point b and we have uh, this is entire complete battery ye ek puri battery hai this is a complete battery that we have this is a complete battery. If I attach this battery with an external resistor, so this was the EMF source, and this was the internal resistance of this. Let's say we have here a resistor which is like this. This is A. This is B. This is E. अब होगा क्या कि इस internal resistance के अंदर कुछ energy dissipate होगी. और ये एक्सटर्नल रेजिस्टर से भी कुछ एनर्जी डिसिपेट होगी करंट एट इज फ्लोइंग इज आई इसको कहते हैं हम आर को इंटरनल रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ द सेल और बैटरी दिस इज द एक्सटर्नल रेजिस्टर द इंटरनल रेजिस्टेंस इज व्हाट इट कॉजेस द चार्ज सर्कुलेटिंग इन द सर्किट टू डिसिपेट सम एनर्जी इट कॉजेस द चार्ज सर्कुलेटिंग in the circuit to dissipate some electrical energy in the power supply itself and what happens is that the power supply becomes warm when it delivers the current to ab jab isme se jab power supply deliver karegi current to warm ho jayegi to jo potential difference across the internal resistance aayega aur jo potential difference across the terminals of the cell aayega uska ek specific naam hai Okay, let's talk about that. We have here the EMF source. We have here internal resistance, and we have here a resistor that I call R. This is the EMF. This is let's say point A. This is point B. The current is I. Is ke cross jo potential difference aayega, usko hum kehte hain V with the subscript R. Or jo is ke cross potential difference aayega, usko hum kehte hain capital V. Ye battery ke cross jo potential difference hai. मतलब बैटरी के बाहर बाहर या बैटरी के क्रॉस मतलब ये पूरी बैटरी पूरी बैटरी की बात कर इस कैपिटल वी को हम कहते हैं टर्मिनल पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस ऑफ द टर्मिनल्स बिकॉज़ इट इज अक्रॉस द टर्मिनल्स ऑफ द बैटरी फ्रॉम ए टिल बी दिस इज इक्वल टू टर्मिनल पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस एंड दिस इज द पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस व्हिच इज अक्रॉस द बैटरी एंड इट्स अ बैटरी के क्रॉस है तो बाहर जो जो चीजें लगी होंगी उसके क्रॉस भी होगी और ये जो वी स्मॉल आर आपको नजर आ रहा है इसको हम कहते हैं लॉस्ट वोल्ट्स because they are they are lost as energy and this is the potential difference across the internal resistance of the battery we call this v with the subscript r is equal to i into r conservation of energy the emf is equal to 
the potential difference across the lost lost folds plus the terminal potential difference obviously kuch idhar aa gaya kuch idhar aa gaya to isko main likh sakta hu is tarah se emf as ir plus v v ko agar main subject bana do this becomes e minus e is the emf minus ir this capital v is what we call the terminal potential difference and the terminal potential difference is across the terminals and anything that comes between a and b outside will have this potential difference. that is capital v so v is known as the terminal potential difference ye aapke paas emf hai aur ye ir aapko jo nazar aa raha hai this is this entire thing is the potential difference across the internal resistance of the pump energy waste ho rahi hai to obviously charge jab flow kar raha hai to wo energy per unit charge is weak so there are lost volts उसका उसका मतलब ये है कि लेट से आपकी ई एम एफ थी थर्टी वोल्ट फाइव वोल्ट लेट से यहाँ पे यूज हो गई इंटरनल रेजिस्टेंस में तो बाकी अगर यहाँ पे कोई बल्ब लगा होगा तो पूरे बल्ब और के क्रॉस कितना वोल्ट आएगा ट्वेंटी फाइव वोल्ट फाइव तो वेस्ट हो गया ठीक है तो ये आपके पास ई एम एफ को रिप्रेजेंट कर रहे हैं ये आपके पास लॉस्ट वोल्ट है और ये ए और बी के क्रॉस जो टर्मिनल है उसके क्रॉस जो आ रहे हैं दिस इज नोन एज द टर्मिनल वॉट इज टर्मिनल पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस A terminal potential difference is the potential difference B across the load. That is outside. It's called the terminal. If the circuit is current flow, then the terminal potential difference is is lesser than the EMF. If the current is flowing, the terminal potential difference is always less than the EMF when the power supply delivers the current. And this is because of the of the potential difference across the internal resistance right so the formula is v is equal to e minus ir and uh, if this thing goes to zero if current goes to zero then what happens agar mere paas ye current zero pe chala jaye to v becomes equal to e so the only point when emf is equal to the terminal potential difference is when the battery is not delivering the current cell with internal resistance is connected to a variable resistor as shown the resistance of r is gradually decreased how do the current and the terminal potential difference across the cell change we have uh, basically v is equal to e minus ir when this resistance decreases the current decreases this figure will go up when this figure will go up and what's going to happen the terminal potential difference is going to decrease you see current current jab badhega to ye cheez badhegi r to fixed hai internal resistance to fixed hai jab current circuit ka badhega to ye cheez dekhe pehle tha ye 20 minus 5 to answer aata tha 15 ab aapke paas ho gaya 20 minus 10 to answer 10 nahi ho jayega current decreases terminal potential difference decreases 